When marketing a region's recreational assets, economic developers love to talk about trails. But can the economic worth of the trails be proven, and more important, improved? Students taking a key graduate course, the Economic Development Studio at Virginia Tech, were handed that task by their professor, John Provo. The New River Trail State Park and the Virginia Creeper Trail, both in southwest Virginia, are former railways converted to recreational use. It was up to nine Virginia Tech graduate students to determine just how those two trails helped the economies of Damascus and Galax and in what ways to improve their effectiveness. But first they had to hear what the clients wanted. If we can quantify the number of folks that are coming as well as the economic impact that they're having, it gives us a much more convincing argument to make to funders and to uh, grant agencies that we have an a, a asset that needs to be taken care of and that their financial support will really make a difference. For students specializing in economic development, the studio acts as a training ground, helping them gain real-world experience. This studio was really useful because you got to take theory that you learned in class and then work with a client. We got to work with the Creeper Trail Club and the New River Trail State Park. They were, it was both, it was interesting working with them, um, figuring out what their needs were, and then finding a solution uh, to the community development issues in the area. The students also traveled to Damascus and Galax to talk with community members, business owners, and trail users about their respective trails and communities. In Damascus and its larger neighbor, Abingdon, the Virginia Creeper has brought bike shops and many tourist-related businesses. Well, working with John Provo, he really gave us free reign to work, to work within our group, to work by ourselves, and come up with these creative solutions on our own. After much collaboration, some struggling, and a lot of hard work, the studio team came up with recommendations centered on community partnerships, marketing, and building on existing local resources. We loved working with this class. These are highly motivated grad students. They did a great job and we would be pleased to recommend their work and the Office of Economic Development to any other clients. For Outreach and International Affairs, this is Andrea Brunet reporting.